Hey, this is my two cents worth. Let's talk about ball position. And I'm going to talk about ball position in the full swing. Chipping and pitching, that's another animal that you kind of create your own sense, your own feel. But for the full swing, my personal belief, there's a couple of things that really have to hold true. Golf is a very right to left sport, meaning as a right hander, it works from the ground up, but it moves right to left. Just like in baseball, just like in football, just like in tennis, you have that ground up sensation of right side, left side. So with that being said, good ball position for full swings will always be, always, this is my feeling, always be center or left of center. Center of my nose, all the way to my shoulder, depending on what length of club I have, i.e. the wedge uh, to the longest club in my bag, which is the driver. So if I'm taking my setup for my wedge, I'm gonna have that ball position right in the middle of my body. And then when I get my driver in hand, I may have it more towards the inside of my left heel. But because right to left is the sensation and the movement that I have in my swing, if I play that ball back to the right or right of center, then I'm not able to have that nice positive move. I'm not able to finish nice and strong, shut the door, so to speak, because my mind's eye tells me, hey, that ball's back here. So when I'm swinging, I have to go back to it. Now I'm kind of a reverse pivot. Always want that right, load up on the right and work, slide and swing to the left. So ball position will allow me to do that. So if you get your nice square position, meaning shoulders, hips, knees, feet are kind of parallel to our target line, ball position is in the middle or slightly left. When I make that motion, I can make that nice right to left, make good impact with that golf ball, hitting it just prior to hit to getting to the bottom of my swing arc. I never want to hit it at the, at the bottom of the swing arc, but just slightly before. So I have that nice downward follow through and I strike it nice and flush and I get the club to do the things that it's designed to do when I've made that correct movement. So again, wedge and anything greater to the driver, nose or to the left. I never want to come back here because my mind's eye tells me that I got to swing back. That doesn't allow me to make that nice right to left athletic motion in the golf swing. Ball position, always be aware of it, make it correct each and every time.